Aryabhatta, the man beyond zero. Aryabhatta was an Indian mathematician, physicist, and astronome. Back on the 5th centuries, during the reign of Gupta dynasty, ancient mathematician Aryabhatta was born and flourished in Kusumpura, near Patliputra, Patna. Aryabhatta gave his date of birth in very interesting way. He wrote in Sanskrit which goes like this, which means three quarters of current yuga and 60 times the 60 year cycle and 23 years have passed since my birth till date. So his date of birth is 21st March 475 CE and he wrote Aryabhatiya on 21st March 499 CE. This genius mathematician's works are Arya Siddhanta, Arya Bhattiya, and Al Nanf. In first two texts, Arya Bhatta explores astronomy, mathematics, and the correlation between the two. Third text, which may have survived in the Arabic translation, is Al Nif or Al Nanf. It claims that it is a translation by Arya Bhatta, but the Sanskrit name of this work is not known. Probably dating from the 9th century, it is mentioned by the Persian scholar and chronicler of India, Abu Rehan Al-Birun. Aryabhatta based his work on the old Pitamaha Siddha. Entire Aryabhatya is consist of 121 shlokas and it's divided into four chapters. That means the text consists of the 108 verses and 13 introductory verses and is divided into Four Padas or Chapters Gitik Pada 13 verses Gani Pada 33 verses Kalkriya Pada 25 verses and Gol Pada 50 verses Gitik Pada 13 verses Large Units of Time Kalpa Manvantara and Yuga which present the cosmology There is also a table of signs which is Jya given in a single verse in Sanskrit which is the duration of the planetary revolutions during a Mahayuga is given as 4.32 million years. Ganit Pada 33 verses covering mensuration, Ketra Vyavhara, arithmetic and geometric progressions, Nomen, shadows, Shankuchaya, simple, quadratic, simultaneous and indeterminate equations, Puttaka, Kalkriya Pada. 25 verses, different units of time, and a method for determining the positions of planets. For a given day, calculations concerning the intercalary month, Adhik Masa, Shaya, Tithis, and a seven-day week, with names for the days of week. Golpada, 50 verses, geometric, trigonometric aspects of the celestial sphere, features of the ecliptic, celestial equator, Node Shape of the Earth Cause of Day and Night Rising of Zodiacal Signs on Horizon Etc. In addition, some versions cite a few colophones, added at the end extolling the virtues of the work, etc. The King of Indian Mathematics Some of the important discoveries he made in the mathematics field are The Place Value System and Zero Trigonometry Algebra Approximation of Pi Indeterminate Equations Some of the Aryabhatta's significant contribution to astronomy includes Solar System Motion Sidereal Periods Eclipses Heliocentrism Writing Numbers as Alphabet The basis of this number system is mentioned in the second stanza of the first chapter of Aryabhatiya is the values for vowels are as follows A equals to 1 I equals to 100 U equals to 10,000 R equals to 10 lakh and so on The Varga letters Ka, Tuma have value from 1 to 3 up to 25 and Avarga letters Ya, Tuha have value 30, 40, 50 up to 100 In the Varga and Avarga letters, beyond the ninth vowel place, new symbols can be used. Like current day's Excel sheet, 
Aryabhatta used this number system for representing both small and large numbers in his mathematical and astronomical calculations. This system can even be used to represent fractions and mixed fractions. For example, Naga is 1 is to 5, Naja is 1 is to 10, and Jhalda, Jha is equal to 9, its half, is equal to 4 plus 1 is to 2. He was the first mathematician in the world to originate the concept of zero. Few millennia before Copernicus and Galileo, Aryabhatta promulgated a heliocentric theory. He taught that the Earth was sphere hanging in the space and rotating on its own axis, resulting in the formation of day and night. He came up with a scientific explanation for the eclipses. Aryabhata discovered an approximation of pi 6 to 8 3 2 by 20,000 is equal to 3.1416. In this stanza, which means 100 added 4 multiplied by 8 and added 62,000. This is the approximate circumference of a circle whose diameter is 20,000. The place value system and concept of zero, which was his biggest contribution, in the field of mathematics. He also correctly believed that the planets and the moon shine by reflected sunlight and that the motion of the stars is due to Earth's rotation. He mentioned about the elliptical movement of the planets rather than the earlier belief of circular movement of planets. Solar and lunar eclipses, which goes like and that is, moon is like water, sun is like fire, Moon obstructs Sun, and shadow of the Earth obstructs Moon, causing eclipses. Some interesting facts about Aryabhatta. The Hindu calendar that is used today was based on Aryabhatta's calculations and is followed for the fixing of the Panchangang. India's first satellite and the lunar crater, Aryabhatta, were named after him. The Aryabhatta Research Institute of Observational Sciences near Nainital in the north of India, set up for research in astrophysics. Astronomy and atmospheric sciences has been named after him. He is considered as the greatest genius of all times and his contributions in the field of mathematics and astronomy are used world over to this day.